The Hamas-run Gaza Health Ministry announced today that more than 40,000 Palestinians have been killed since Israel launched its war to destroy Hamas after the group massacred 1,200 people last October. The figure does not distinguish between fighters and civilians. Israel says it has killed 17,000 Hamas terrorists and warned civilians to evacuate dangerous areas. But the Gaza Strip is closed off. Most people can't leave. Three analysts tonight tell NBC News 40,000 is likely an undercount. Reem is five months old and cries constantly. Her grandmother thinks it's because she was breastfeeding when her mother was killed and now won't take formula. She will live as an orphan, Annette says. The Israeli military responded to our request for information, saying in part, in stark contrast to Hamas's intentional attacks on Israeli men, women, and children, the IDF follows international law and takes feasible precautions to mitigate civilian harm. Negotiations to stop the fighting and free the hostages still held by Hamas resume today. So far, no sign of a breakthrough. Lester. All right, Richard Angle, thank you. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.